Mmm. I actually got the design flaw on camera. Let's try that again. There it goes. That's cool. Rest in peace for the Edwards round horn that used to be there. I'm not saying that like I have seen it personally, but that's what used to be in this building. They had an Edwards system from 1956. Then the building was added onto sometime in the 60s, I believe, and it had simplex horns, either 4040s or 4050s. And I don't know if there's anything after that. What I do know is this system was replaced with notifier uh, and all the old stuff was ripped out and they put these guys in, which arguably work a lot better. It's just sad that the old system's gone, you know? Right here is some pretty interesting conduit work because um, originally that's where the, the old Edwards horn was and rather than put new holes in the wall they just reused that pass through. Uh, I presume they probably used the old wire uh, to pull new wire through because there's more than knack coming out of that. Um, we got SLC and knack. And this is where the old pole station would have been, probably a 270 SPO. Rather than reuse the box, they opted to install a new box. Right here. And yeah, it's a pretty interesting setup they had.
We love enunciators. But yeah, this, uh, this is the area that had the simplex horns. As you can see, they are non-existent anymore. They passed wires through the old like grill and then came up into the ceiling to drop these. Um, there's an old school bell over here that's still intact. But other than that, there's not much in the original systems. And there's a bell there, but that's long disconnected. There would have been a flush horn there. 